Hello and welcome to this tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to consider a numeracy pass question on the application of the perimeter, the first of its kind in the pass question series. Now, before we proceed, make sure you click on the subscribe button, like, and share. Let's proceed to the question. Now, in our previous discussion, we looked at the question 2a. Okay, so this time we are going to look at the question 2b. Let's proceed to the main question. A farmer had a plot of land measuring 25 meters by 50 meters. He built a fence, leaving a margin of 2 meters wide all around it as shown in the figure 2. Find the total length of the fence. So this is the figure 2 they are referring to. Okay, now this is the land highlighted yellow within the boundary that is a fence okay so you realize that the fence here is a rectangular fence because the measurement even was given to us to be 25 meters by 15 meters in other words the length is 25 meters and the breadth or the width is 15 meters okay so we are going to figure out how to calculate the total length of the fence used Let's proceed. Now, this is just a duplicate of the same diagram. This time we are going to illustrate to actually get the length of the, the measurement of the length and, and, of, and of course the breadth, as you can see on the screen. Now let's ask ourselves, what is the length and what is the breadth? Now to determine the breadth, you realize that from here to here is 2 meters. Then from here to here is 50 meters. Then of course from this place to this place also are 2 meters. Now you realize that I can easily trace to this side. That means that from this portion to this side is 2 centimeters. I can also equally trace the 50 meters to this side. Alright. And now that's 17 so far. And of course the last aspect if you also include it that will give you of course 19 as you can see on the screen. Okay, so we have 19 meters, as you can see on the screen. Now this 19 meters, since it's a rectangle, a rectangle has its opposite size to be equal. So I can also equally trace it to the other side, and that will also give you the same 19 meters. So we, now we know two of the width. This side is 19, this is also 19, because rectangles have opposite size to be equal. Now what of the length? Okay, we can also trace from this side here to have 2 centimeters as at the boundary. We can also trace from this side down here and that will also be an addition of our 25 meters. Adding to that, that will be 27. Then of course the last aspect, if you also bring it down, you get to realize that we are going to have a total of 29 meters for the length. And again, since the opposite sides of a rectangle are equal, we can also trace it to the other side as well. And now we have all the four sides. And since we have all the four sides, we can now calculate the total length of the fence. Now, since we are looking for the total length, what do we do? Now, the total length of the fence is simply going to give us 29 meters plus 29 meters plus 19 meters plus 19 meters. Okay? And to do this, you just simply use your calculator. All right. I advise that in examination, don't say, oh, I know math. I can easily do it. Let me use my head, please. Always try to verify your answers with a calculator. So we have here 29 plus 29 plus 19 plus 19. This equals 96. Okay. That equals 96. So what it means is that our total length or the total length of the fence is simply going to give us 96 meters. I hope this is quite clear. Let's look at another alternative approach to this. Okay. For those of you who are aware of the perimeter formula, we have another alternative. You can do that. All right. So let's go ahead. Now, this is alternative method one. 
You are very much aware that perimeter is simply equal to 2L plus 2W, where L is the length and W is the what? The width. Okay? Actually, the first approach I used is to enable you do it straightforward without using the formula. But here, you can use the formula you can use the formula 2L plus 2W, where L is the length and W is the width. Now, substituting our values, you know the length is 29 meters and the width is 19 meters. So when we substitute the values, we're now going to have 2 times of 29 meters plus 2 times of 19 meters. Okay? And that will simplify to 58 meters plus 38 meters. Because 2 times 29 meters is 58 meters. And 2 times 19 meters is what? 38 meters. Okay? So, what does that give us? 58 meters plus 38 meters will simply give us the answer 96 meters. You can also just verify your calculation straightforward. Okay? By... Also, substituting the values into the formula, we have here 2 times 29, bracket close, plus 2 times 19, bracket close. What does that give us? 96. It means our answer is correct. And we can leave the examination hall dancing and smiling, knowing very well that all our answers have been verified. Okay. So... Therefore, the total length of the fence is simply equal to 96 meters. Okay, now let's look at another third alternative method or another alternative method. And that is also going to involve another formula for perimeter. Okay, let's proceed further. Now let's consider the second alternative method. We are aware that perimeter is simply equal to 2L plus 2W as we used in the previous formula. Now you see that 2 is a factor in both terms. So we can factor it out and that will simply give us perimeter is equal to 2 times L plus W. Bracket close where L is the length and W is the width. So once again, we can substitute our values inside. Our L is 29 meters and our W is 19 meters. Or in other words, our length is 29 meters and our W is 19 meters. Alright, so we put it in the bracket and again multiply by 2. Okay, so deal with the bracket first. Okay. Now when you, sum, uh, when you simplify the items in the bracket, what do you have? You're going to have 48 meters. Because 29 plus 19 meters gives you 48 meters. And now multiplying that by 2, alright, and that lands us with the same answer which is 96 meters. Okay, so... Here, here as well, you can also use the calculator to verify. Alright, so just type your 2 outside, bracket open, um, 29 plus 19. And that will give us the answer, let's press equal to 96 meters, as you can see on the screen. So this answer is also verified as well. And what do we do? We can therefore now conclude that the total length of the fence is also equal to 96 meters. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, make sure you subscribe and share the content of our channel across all platforms. And please don't forget to subscribe if you are new to this channel. Kindly subscribe because YouTube is not promoting our content because our number of subscribers is quite a uh, challenge now. Okay. The more you subscribe, the more these, uh, these our videos can reach the larger population. And for that matter, we can help people all over the world and even wherever they might find themselves, especially all those who have interest in writing the teacher's licensure exam, whether in Ghana, Nigeria, Ghanaians who are in Ghana, Nigeria, or wherever they are. So please, kindly subscribe. It is very important to us. Thank you for your time and may God bless you. Goodbye.